Hey, welcome back. We're the Kanpai guys. We Kanpai, so you don't have to. Unless you want to. So, what's today's drink? Today's drink is Ichiko. Ichiko is a shochu. Ichiko is the drink of Japan. Ichiko is what we're drinking today. Ichiko is. Are you okay? Ichiko Shochu is the native spirit of Japan, a white spirit that's incredibly rich in flavor, yet smooth and easy to drink with food. Ichigo is made from 100% two roll barley fermented with koji. Ichigo is a true expression of a pristine, natural environment. Ichigo is crafted in Oita Prefecture in Kyushu. Ichiko uses water sources that are naturally filtered through 1,000 feet of volcanic rock. Ichiko is the result of a true harmony between nature and science. Ichiko, pronounced Ichiko, derives from a dialect spoken in the Okinawa prefecture of Japan and translates to It's Great. So I've been saying Ichiko wrong this entire time. Ichiko. Ichiko is a Honkaku Shochu, the highest grade of Shochu. Ichiko is distilled in Oita Prefecture on Kyushu Island. Did I say that already? You may have. Wait, how many pages of this do you have? 17. All right, well, is this a world record in PR? You're doing such a great job that I'm just going to stop you right there. Okay. David, that was beautiful. Ichiko. <clears throat> Have you ever had Ichiko before? Remember, Ichiko. 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 I have had Ichiko before. So Ichiko make many types of shochu. Uh, they have like the cheaper one, which we did on a live show once. That's right. Yeah, we covered it once <clears throat> on the show. The regular one is about 800 yen. It comes in like a see-through bottle, like a stained glass bottle. And it's 20 or 25%. This one is Ichiko Silhouette. It's a very classy box. He's back at it. <laughs> Ichiko Silhouette is, was, Awarded a gold at the LA International Spirits Competition and a silver medal at the San Francisco World Spirits Competition. You're finished. I'm finished, yeah. That's it. Well, that's impressive. <laughs> oh, so, so it's won some gold medals. This one has <clears throat> the silhouette. As you can see, we had another hard week at the Campai Guys studios, so we have resorted back to small bottles after <laughs> the... Uh... <laughs> so this is a 200 milliliter version. The 700 milliliter version uh, does not come in a box like this. Hmm. This um, might be more for gifting. Maybe. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. <clears throat> and this one was 400 yen. That is insanely cheap. A very short story about this. Ichiko is the first. You got, got a knife or a gun you're about to pull out? Uh, <laughs> I was going to stop you right there. I was going to stop you right there, but <clears throat> please continue. continue. When I lived in England, about 12 or 13 years ago, in London, we used to have a Mitsukoshi department store. Really? Yeah. In London? Uh, Mitsukoshi is a nationwide department store in Japan. I went there to eat like ramen one day when I was first getting interested in Japan and they had a Japanese supermarket 
and they had an alcohol section. And all these, like... At that time, I didn't know anything about shochu or sake or anything like that. And this one kind of stood out to me. One, for the bottle design. And two, for the price. Because it was on the cheaper end. Compared to the price in Japan, it was very overpriced. Now I know that. Right, yeah. So, in Japan, the full-size bottle of this Ichigo Silhouette is a uh, thousand yen, about a thousand yen. And I paid 23 pounds. How much would that be in, in yen or US dollars? About three and a half to four thousand yen. Yeah, so you paid that import price for it. Four times the price, right? Yeah. But then it was very exotic to me, or expensive. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, would you like to know how Silhouette is enjoyed? I'm assuming it on the rocks, or up with water. They actually have several ways, so they suggest enjoying it straight, on the rocks, mixed with water both hot and cold, or served in a shochu highball, so mixed with soda. They even suggest you can mix it with oolong or matcha tea. Ah, okay, yes, that, that's also quite popular. This is a mugi shochu, so this shochu is made of wheat. If you've never had shochu before, I guess the closest you would describe it to would be vodka. It For me, it's less yeah. harsh than vodka, though. Yeah, it's weaker, so shochu uh, is generally around 20-25% alcohol. Yeah. Also, I find shochu to be much easier to drink than sake. Ah, uh, me too, yeah. Yeah, mm. this sake messes me up every time. On our previous day of filming, we had a little bit of sake on the show to review. Oh, just a Yeah, just a little bit. bit. But I had a migraine the next day, like really bad. <laughs> from that? Just, okay. just from that. You suffer from migraines. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Lay off the sake, I think. But yeah. I don't have that effect <clears throat> with, uh, with shochu. First, we're going to try it on the rocks, and then as a highball. Cool. Let's do it. Ichigo is served. On the rocks. Oh, okay, sorry, I thought you were about to like read another. Passage. I'm just describing how we put it out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it is, yes. Ichiko silhouette. Is. Is. The traditional expression of shochu. This one should be lighter and eminently drinkable. And this one, Silhouette, pairs well with a wide range of cuisines and is traditionally enjoyed with food. Very, very delicious scent. Fragrant. Yes. It's very fragrant. Like a mix between like, like the sweetness of a bakery, but also mm. like a very feminine perfume at the same time. That's funny you say that. It is quite floral, isn't it? Yeah. For shochu. Sometimes you drink shochu, there's just not much to it, really. But this does have complexity. It's, it's like it has the sweetness of like a sugar cookie, but also like the, the elegance of a like perfume Yeah. at the same time. It's very interesting. It's a good smell. Yeah. yeah. Like if you don't pay attention to the smell of shochu, you should really like smell this one. Yeah. It does have a good smell. Come back. Come back. Goes down like water. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> There's no burn. No, not at all. Uh, aftertaste. Yeah, the finish is like mineral water. Like even though it's 25%, it doesn't really taste like it's 25%. There's no burning on the palate either. No. There's like a slight like metallic, like something metal in your mouth, like a screw or you know, like a, a coin or something. Yeah. Mm. Slightly, yeah, like yeah. that kind of, that kind of taste. Dangerous stuff. <laughs> <laughs> whoever, whoever named this did a great job. The silhouette. I thought you meant Ichiko. It's great. Well, that too, but I would definitely buy this again. And again, this bottle was 400 yen. 400 yen, yeah. So about four US dollars. 200 milliliter. That's, yeah. 
It's a great deal for something this good. I think I've already decided my my compi score. <laughs> <laughs> Should we have a high ball though? Why not? Let's give it a shot. All right, so we've prepared the Ichigo silhouette as a high ball. Yeah, you're actually still getting the same scent, even though it's in a high ball, right? This is like, it's like drinking water. This is insane. Basically. <laughs> <laughs> you could spike someone's drink. You could spike someone's water and they would never know. <laughs> Attention everyone, the punch has been spiked! <gasps> if you want to get drunk, or if you want to get a little loosey-goosey, but you don't like the taste of uh -huh. anything, or if you just don't like flavors, <laughs> <laughs> go with the Ichigo Silhouette with soda water. <laughs> Alex, would you like to hear some Amazon reviews? I'd love to, yeah. Most people seem to think it's like a beginner's shoju. So the first review is a 3 out of 5 uh, star review on Amazon Japan. Translated to English. No expense spared in the algorithm. <laughs> uh, the title of this review is... Kana for beginners? I wonder if it's for beginners? Mm. I have been shy away from cheapy until now. But I thought I could buy it. I will try to smell the smell right away, as expected fragrance is reasonable impression. The best for the first cup of the start to drink because not too sweet like Kichi Yotsukuro. That was like a machine gun's worth of Nonsense. words thrown at me. <laughs> words. <laughs> But the flavour is faded so that I do not know what I'm drinking since the ice starts to melt on the way. Think of the price. It may be good for a cold straight to a king king. King king. A cold straight. A cold straight. Like drinking it cold and straight. Since this alone is uh, tough on the contrary, I drink in a style that transitions to a rich taste when I get drunk around. I go get drunk around. Round town. Miwasake is often thinking about drinking people and developing products. It is a fluorite. It is a fluorite? Okay. <laughs> That's one of the most bizarre reviews we've covered. It's one of those bizarre... Just paragraphs of words obviously. let's move on to the next review i think okay. let's just uh take that one scramble it up and just <laughs> chuck it over there <laughs> put that one in the question mark pile. Uh, in the campfire guys studio we do have like a massive pile of garbage of old stuff we drunk so i'm just gonna take that review yep. shove it over there Pew. so the next review is four out of five stars shot you like a beautiful painting with a sense of transparency i can agree with that what well, point number one there is only barley, there is no habit, there is no straight aroma, soft sweetness, gentle shochu. Point number two. From the intent of bottle design, I think it is an image like a beautiful painting of ink ink and pencil drawing with a sense of transparency. It is also recommended for beginners of shochu. That's a pretty spot on review. Okay, so we have one more review, five out of five. Yappari delicious. I live in a rural area, so I cannot see it quite. And it is helpful to have delivery by Prime. Shout out to the Amazon here, I think. Yep. Drink refreshing deliciously with carbonated. So this person's saying they live out in the countryside somewhere where they can't access this shochu very conveniently. Can this be purchased at convenience stores? I've seen it in a couple of convenience stores. Okay, so not every convenience no. store. No. Do you think we should give this uh, just an overall campfire score, just for this Ichigo silhouette? There's nothing to complain about. It is delicious, but also at the same time it is pure nothingness. I'll give it nine campfires. Nine. Nine. Me too. Mm -hmm. 
just for the fact that it can be so smooth and taste nothing like alcohol yet be you know alcohol <laughs> substantially <laughs> alcoholic and also smell fantastic yeah it smells great well actually this was the first exclusive shochu video we did on this channel you're right <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. No, i'm very interested to try other ichigo shochus uh, we will be reviewing more ichigo shochus and of course other companies shochus as well we re but we could review a new bottle once a day for this for the rest of our lives and we wouldn't run out maybe. yeah we we wouldn't make it through all of them probably <laughs> probably right 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 <laughs> <laughs> if you like this video uh please give us a like if you're new to the channel please consider subscribing uh, if you do want to see more short tree videos please let us know in the comments below and uh, please hit the notification icon for updates when we go live or post new videos. Ichiko is... Over and out.